Yeah, they crazy. Mm. Hey, pay me that glove right there. Uh uh, not the regular one. You want right there with the button on it. Yeah, right there. Yo. Drop that uh. shit, man. Uh. Huh. Hey, when it comes to DR Fahrenheit, we stand on number but principles and morals. We stand on all business, you feel me? But hey, man, all just aside, hey, man, what's good? John Quinn Chow with another freaking video today. And today I'm coming to y'all with a highly requested video. Y'all keep on asking me when I'm gonna do another one. When I'm gonna do another radius video. When I'm gonna reach out collections again. And today I'm coming to y'all with another one. I ain't got nothing but time on my hands today. But hey man, today I'm gonna do it a little different, okay? I see it's a lot more people requesting. And at the rate I'm going, I'm not gonna get to all y'all. So I came up with a little, you know what I'm saying, you know, with my billionaire mind, you feel me? I came up with a little genius plan. So from now on, since the demand is higher, I'ma just increase the work rate I do on that. So in this video, I'ma knock out 30 of y'all collections. And if y'all don't get in this one, y'all know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna be in the next one, you feel me? I'm doing them more and more and more at a time. But this is a new update, okay? I'm only gonna recommend you guys something if I really think you need it. If I don't think you need a recommendations, I'm not really gonna recommend anything, you feel me? From now on, I'm just strictly gone like, Put my primary focus on rating y'all fragrances and seeing if y'all need to upgrade or not. But yeah, that's it for the intro. Let's hop straight into this motherfucker, man. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, first up, we got Mega Mansion. Then you got Mega Bands. Um, first of all, I, this dude has everything. <laughs> y'all can y'all be having the stuff I want, man. Man, I how much money do y'all got? I really want to. I really want to know how much money do y'all got, bro? But all just aside, I think your best thing about your collection is how you ain't, like your collection is very versatile. You don't have just one. You know what I'm saying? How some people have only freshies, some people have only sweets, some people just have only. You know what I'm saying? You got some of everything, and then you mix the niche with the um designer fragrances, which I'm a big fan of. I know some people hate on designer for what, man? Not all of us can afford them 300, 400, 500 dollars just to spend on some flavor water. Come on, man. But you know what I'm saying? I really rock with the collection. I read about a cool, smooth nine, nine and a half, you know what I'm saying? In my opinion, you don't need no um, recommendation. You good, bro. Just keep it going. All right, next up, bro guy. Okay, I'm, again, I'm loving how you guys mix the designer with the niches, you feel me? I'm a big fan of that. And he got one of my favorites, initial side effect, you know what I'm saying? Look like he good on, I'm not too much a bigger fan of um, Greenwich Village, like I said in the, um, uh, before you got some time for it i can't really tell what it is up there you got savage elixir okay 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 it seems like you good bro but what i recommend is you know what i'm saying you you keep on expanding to your niche you feel me i feel like you got a good idea of what you're doing you feel me even though i don't really like some of them i'm a big fan because i see you know what you're doing and i like the direction you're heading in so i'm gonna get this collection about a cool eight eight and a half you feel me it might be small but the quality is hot that's why I, that's why i get such a high rate all right next up first thing i'm noticing bro got tuxedo girls dior okay he doesn't really um oh that's a Gris Dior my bad <laughs> but um he got he you know what I'm saying he a cool little fan of Dior what is that blue de Chanel top is that what in the world old royal okay he got some his fragrance type is his very his fragrance, his nose is very um high quality you feel me he like that high dollar shit he not too much a fan of that low dollar shit. But what's conf what's really confusing me out this group is um Versace Auto Parfum, which I would swap that out for something higher, something something more quality. What what, what do I swap that for? I say probably swap it out with some Creed or something just to make it a little bit higher quality. Cause out of this whole collection, that's the one that stands out for you know what I'm saying the lowest quality. So you feel me? Just swap out that Versace Earl's Flame. I will personally would, but if you a fan of it, keep it there. But yeah, I read this collection by the cool cool um eight and a half just because i'm not really a fan of too much other everything but I, I respect it i really respect it bro it's a cool high top dollar fragrance um collection but hey in my opinion you don't need to keep growing bro i feel like you got a good collection right here you feel me but if you need to keep growing go ahead go keep on expanding bro all right next up first thing i'm noticing two ysls uh two dior's blue chanel parfum one of my babies dylan blue my bondage and spirit Okay, in my opinion, you 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 um you got too many freshies. You got too much of the same stuff. You got YSL YDT, then you got Versace Dylan. Well, you can count out Dylan Blue because Dylan Blue is kind of its own thing. Well, no, I do see you got Dylan Blue and Blue Chanel Parfum. I feel like there's no point in having those two. Mont Blanc Legend Spirit, Nautical Voyage. Yeah, you just got these three awkward same things to me, which I 
I'm not really a fan of. I would swap Nautical Voyage out of there and just swap it for something more sweeter. Or you could swap it out and go Spice Bomb or something. But I feel like you don't need three of the same things, you feel me? And with Blue Chanel Pop Foam and Dylan Blue, I feel like those are two kind of similar, you feel me? But but if I were you, I would swap that Versace Dylan Blue for something a little more niche, you feel me? For um Cree, I think it was Cree's Miz Imperial, something like that. I'm just saying Cree Imperial. But it's aquatic, it's airy, um, it's slightly fruity, you feel me? It's not cheap smelling. And um, yeah, I feel like you could upgrade from that, but I just feel like you got too much of the same freshies, you feel me? But yeah, keep on going, game. I rate this collection about a cool seven and a half, you feel me? It's small, gets the job done, you know what I'm saying? It got good performance, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no bad performance in here, for real. You just gotta swap out those freshies, game. All right, next, uh, Greenwich Village, um, Parfums of Mine, Aqua de Palma. Okay, 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 okay. Ben, I gotta try out that Bentley Man Intense. I gotta, people say they love it. I gotta try it out. People say it don't even smell as much as it costs. It costs like around like $26 or something. I gotta try it out. But yeah, this collection is cool. You feel me? I see you gotta, you like to vary your taste. You feel me? But something I'm not really a fan of that just stands out to me in this um whole little collection is this Aqua de Palma. I'm not really too much a fan of that whole line. That whole line's got to go to me. Me personally, I'm just not much of a fan of it. I would honestly downgrade to something like Dylan Blue, like in the last collection, or go to something like Blue de Chanel, Eau de Parfum, or EDT, you know what I'm saying? But I feel like Aqua de Palma, nah, bro, I'm straight on that. Then a struggle with you and Tesla. Yeah, you got, a, you got a good collection going, gang. I rate this cool collection by the cool, um, seven i'm not really too much a fan of 3ds but you feel me it's a cool collection i can still respect it just keep on growing and keep expanding and keep on finding your taste and just expand from there all right next up okay first off the picture quality is insane you gotta tell me what filter you use gang okay we got dior we got long sport is that all extreme yeah all extreme lobo versace was playing okay i'm i'm really liking the collection it's simplistic it's cool it's not too much going on i'm saying i'm really liking hold on do you got two of the same is that both is that two white so yups i cannot tell but yeah in my opinion you headed in a good direction game just keep it going um in my opinion i would swap that um mont blanc explorer out for something like creed just to have another niche in there and just to add some more high top notch high quality frequencies in there you feel me but to me you know what i'm saying i'm loving the designer mixed with the niche you feel me just keep on expanding your niche side and you'll be straight but i get this question but a cool Cool seven and a half, you feel me? It's straight. It's, it's not it's some calm shit, you feel me? Not too much going on, but it's straight. Get the job done. Alright, next up. Oh uh, bro, just y'all, y'all in these y'all in these shells, bro. I just I I don't know about them. I just don't trust them. I feel like if somebody was to find out why this is where I had them or something like that, I would just people would just spray them and come in there and spray whatever they want anytime. I just I'm not I'm not too much affinity shit. But I like the design though. I just don't like how easy access accessible they are. But um if you could just shit me out, what do I want out of this clutch? Cause I know you I, I know you got me, man. I know you got me. So go ahead and shit me out. Um I want one of them creeds. Uh fuck it. Just just give me Dorsey about the 180p and give me one of them creeds and we straight gang, you feel me? Fuck no. But no, I'll just decide this collection is a cool, cool nine and a half. It gets the extra little point because of the setup. I like how the setup is, you feel me? I love these shelf designs and it's how they stack in these closets and stuff like that. It's cool. All right, next up, what the fuck? Bruh, is this a, what even, what do you call those things where they, it's the little, is that a bonk? Or is or am I slow? To be honest, I don't really know none of these like bottom lines. I just know the top row. All right, something I would recommend that you add is actually Versace Arrows, or you can add Arrows Flame to add a little bit more spices in there. But I do think you need a little bit more spices in there. I feel like you got your sweetness down packed and you got your freshness down packed because I'm pretty sure all those down there are some type of freshies, you feel me? And I'm pretty sure none of those are spicy. So I feel like you should add some spices with either one of those Versace Arrows. But since I don't know more than half of these, I'm gonna just get us about a cool six. You feel me? Um, cause I don't know what these are, but it's a cool collection, bro. Keep it going. All right, next up, uh, Ombre Leather. Not too much a fan of two Hugo Boss. So why you listen? Another four Hugo Boss is crazy, gang. You know what? Never mind. I don't even gotta judge, cause you probably you probably like them so much. That's probably why you buy them so much. You know what? I'm not even gonna judge. You don't even gotta do them. 
But honestly, suggest you swap out that polo for something like Blue de Chanel, you feel me? Just something to add a little bit more fresh, more professional take on this collection. But if I'm being honest, this collection is a cool six and a half to me. It's not too much going on. It's pretty much of the same stuff, but I don't blame them, you feel me? If this junk is working for them, hey, keep it going, bro. Fuck my rigging. Keep it going. If this is working for you, keep it going. Hold on, y'all. I need a smoke break right quick. I just been talking so fast. I need a little smoke break. Hold on. But hey man, next up, this man collection is only money, only high quality freaks. Okay, I really rock with it. I like how it's simple, effective. It's two time forwards. I don't really know what those are. And then he got, I've never seen this brand in my life. Um, But you can tell, bro just only likes high quality fragrances, you feel me? In my opinion, span, span, expand on to bond number nine, you feel me? That's another good one. And in my opinion, I feel like you, you if you like time forward, you would love MFK. MFK is like time for a brother and sister, you feel me? But yeah, if you only like niche, only keep it that way, you feel me? You don't need to come down to designer, especially if you got the money. Hey, keep on spending these bands, man. Hey, but it's, it is crazy to think about that this is like over probably like two to three bands in colognes, bro. Two to three thousand dollars in just only fragrances. That's not crazy to y'all. Like, I really be thinking that when I see y'all mega collections. But hey, my suggestion is smell some more Mason Francis Kerjohn fragrances and smell some Bond number nines and just keep on spending it there. If you don't want to expand, it's straight, bro. But hey, since I only know what 40s is because the rest, I don't, I don't know what them time fours is. I don't know what these bullhead is. This strong muscle hood ass case. But um, I had this collection by the cool nine, you feel me? It's simple, it's effective, it's not too much going on, but it is high quality though. I like that. All right, next up, okay. Oh, my bro got my own, my little, the top of confidential. Hey, this is this thing low key grew on me, bro. Like, at first I was like, I'm not really too much a fan of it, but now like, it's become like almost my daily. It smells amazing, bro. And it's unique. Puffles the Molly, Savage Elixir, Armani Cole. And then the Rex are just probably Arabian clone. I don't know what none of this stuff is, except for those three. The rest of these are just probably Ar Arabian clones. But yeah, since I really don't know too much about this stuff, I really can't, you know what I'm saying, rate it for real. But what I can say is keep on expanding. You seem like you got good taste and you seem like you know what you're doing, bro. Just keep on expanding, keep on finding what you're doing. And I rate the collection, I can't really give it a, you know what I'm saying, accurate rating. But it's about a cool, you know what I'm saying, eight. Probably is a nine if he lives in Arabia. Cause that's probably all he sells. And if he got his hands on Puffles, the Marley, Salvage, Risk, and the Marty Cole, he's probably the most unique smelling out there. So, hey, man, keep it going, bro. And, uh, yeah. All right, next up, okay. Three MFKs, Ooh, Samu, Initio, Tom Ford, Louis Vuitton. Okay, we got we got another money baller here, okay? We got we got some more money here, all right? Bottom them in our New York Knights, okay? With Sassy Hella. Okay, I like how he mixes it up, you feel me? Another one. I like how you guys mix the designer with the niche, you feel me? You don't, you don't need to have just one, but designer with niche, I feel like you got the best of both worlds, gang. Valentino, okay, I don't know I don't know what some of these are. Blanc Blanc Legend Red. I've never seen that Mercedes with the blue cap. I've never seen, that's probably some 2004 shit. I've never seen that in my life. I feel like this is a good stack collection, you feel me? I feel like it has a lot going for itself. It's diverse, it's straight, has niche and designer. It's not too much you can, you know what I'm saying, really add to this that would increase the points. It's just a straight cool collection. It's not too much necessary to add, you know what I'm saying, more stuff. But hey, I read this collection about a cool eight, eight and a half, you feel me? It's stacked, it's cool. I'm not really too much a fan of some of this stuff, but I like a majority of it. Next up, we got four, okay. Let's get Bond, Dylan Blue, my black spoiler them all. Okay, simple. But the one main thing I do see is that None of these are good performers for real, for real. Like Lamar and especially the Dolce & Gabbana, the one. So what I would suggest is you swap out either one of those. You can either swap out Dolce & Gabbana, the one for Le Parfum, actually. Or you can swap out, um, you can swap out Lamar for what can you swap out for? Probably go something a little higher quality, like Zerjoff, Naxos, you feel me? Something still fresh, versatile, free, fruity, sweet, you feel me? Just something to swap out these not low performance because i feel like you do need something that's going to last all day none of these are really good you know what i'm saying performance that's just going to stay there all day but i like the collection it's a cool calm collection you feel me it's not too much over the top it's still some calm shit you feel me just to stay cool calm keep four once you one out of one just replace them that's it but this collection by the cool feel me seven and a half you feel me get the job done it's simplistic but effective all right next up we got my woman lucky love parfum sauvage 
Okay, 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 okay. I think we got similar noses, you feel me? I love like, I'm really loving all these except for the middle one. I have no idea what this is. I think it's some pretty, yes, yeah, Arabian. The bottom two, yep, Arabian two. But he has a very sweet nose. And even with his Savage EDP, he could have went EDT, but I feel like he went EDP because it's a little bit more smoother. But I feel like this collection is good for now. I feel like there's no point in upgrading unless you already want to just break the chain and just step up to niche fragrances, you feel me? I feel like it's just no point to keep on collecting designer fragrances because I feel like once you like, you know what I'm saying, stack up enough money, go ahead and go to niches and then start expanding from there. But I get this collection about a cool seven and a half, you feel me? Simple, effective, get the job done, not too much going on, but gets the job done. All right, next up, I mean, Lucky Cabrano, okay, La Parfum, Gucci Guilty, okay, I really like that. Uh, Two loans, okay, that's the first problem I see, is a Vaj EDP. Okay, in my opinion, you gotta swap out one of those. You need to go wide sale line the wheat if you still wanna keep it fresh, but you want something sexy for the date nights, or you can go wide sale long La Parfum, which is more for like i use for like hotter days i liked it for the hotter days you know what i'm saying days where i'm going on like amusement parks like six flags or something like that but you swap i need i think you need to swap out one of those but besides that it's a cool calm collection you feel me i also would probably swap out the savage edp for something like blue chanel parfum just to separate itself a little bit more from that gucci guilty because it kind of is still close to the same uses but yeah it's straight bro just keep it going and i rate this collection by the cool 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 sound it's cool sound straight you feel me like i always say simple effective get the job done we don't need too much over here all right next up uh, okay this man got two boobies okay two booby fragrances okay phantom azaro okay it's a cool collection you feel me sweet boy lover sweet boy lover i like that but i do have to say i feel like you need to start off with niche but i would recommend going to bond number nine new york nights i feel like bond number nine new york nights is it'll it'll still keep it sweet like how you love it that caramel no it what it's i feel like it's what makes me gravitate towards new york nights so much but yeah if you got the funds don't don't go broke buying it now but if you got the funds go on joma shop purchase it that's that's that's, that's gonna be a banger to this collection bro but I get this collection about a cool ache. His nose is very sweet, which I am a sweet lover. Pause. I'm a sweet lover for these fragrances. And yeah, he has every sweet one, you feel me? Besides that polo up top. All right, next up, we got a video. So let's go ahead and get this started. Okay, Kamara, okay. It's hot wash. Okay, starting out great. Club New Week, okay, got the boxes, okay. I'm loving this, man. Okay. Um, you had me. I, I swear on everything. You, it was going so good, then it dropped, then it went back up. But um, you know what? I'm not gonna talk about. It. I'm gonna just erase that bullshit that I just seen from my memory. Two juke. Let me take a smoke break. The fuck. <sighs> but everything besides those three fragrances. I'm a fan of, bro. Hey, keep it going, bro. Keep on stacking your collection. Honestly, I feel like you know what you're doing. There's no point of me recommending you anything. But yeah, keep it going. You're headed in the right direction, gang. Just keep on stacking brands and brands and brands. If you do plan on having a huge collection, just, I feel like, add more to the Spice Bomb collection. You know what I'm saying? Grab um, Infrared, grab Night Vision, and then that'll finish, that'll finish out that brand. But hey, if you just want to stack out brands, keep it going, bro. I'm sorry I'm going to have to give it a four, bro. Because those three... It dropped you down too bad. I'm sorry. But if it wasn't for those three, cool eight and ten. Straight, straight cool collection, simple, effective. Okay, next up, Safari's Versace Flame EP. Okay, okay, okay. Scandal. Hey, he got one of them motherfuckers in there. You feel me? Hey, Scandal. Hey, in my opinion, this is a cool collection, gang. Cool, 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 cool collection, you feel me? I don't I don't think you need to add or change anything. But something I would suggest is change that Dolce Gabbana K for Prada Little Rose of Carbon. And either for my suggestion for your scandal, you either refill up, restock up on your scandal, get a bigger bottle, or if you got, you know what I'm saying, you got the funds, you got the funds, go ahead and upgrade the bond number nine New York Nights, you feel me? Like I said, it has caramel in there, it's higher quality, but if, to be honest, if you don't feel like it, just refill up on that scandal and you'll be straight. All right, next up, okay. Just making a whole bunch of freshies that I kind of don't really know in the back. I see, is that two nauticals? Three nautical? Okay, he just got a whole bunch of the same in the back. Okay, that kind of loses points for me. Then you got poor home. Then you got okay, that kind of loses points for me because you just got pretty much the same. You got you got pretty much the same of everything. You feel me? 
And I feel like you kind of need to swap it up a little bit. Like something like Rasasi Hawass. And you can have Poor Home and Rasasi Hawass because I feel like even though Rasasi Hawass is fresh and it's still considered a summer fragrance, it adds a little something different. It's fruity and it adds a little bit of sweetness in there, you feel me? Poor Home, I feel like you can keep that. But all that other BS in the back, I feel like there's no point of having all that. I feel like that's just a waste of money and it's just gonna sit there because you got Poor Home right here and you got Rasasi right here. Okay, but I do like, I'm not really too much a fan of Versace Denim Blue Jeans, but I think you're not a fan of it either because that just, hey, I do got a question though. Why does everybody that have blue jeans bottle so full? That don't make y'all think like, they don't even like it either. They just add it to their collection. To be honest, I read this collection about a, it's about a five to me, you feel me? But since I do see you not really, you know, you know what I'm saying? You probably don't have all the money, you probably don't have all the funds, which is straight to me. But I would suggest is that you, you know what I'm saying, look into some Latafa fragrances, look into some clones of popular fragrances. Like me, you feel me? I got this Latafa Confidential, $15, smell good. It's different from the Freshies, that's all back here. It's, it's tropical, but it's still light. Then you got my cocktail right here, you feel me? Not too much more, it's $30, you feel me? Sweet, great, amazing. It's, it's more than just going in person and finding these cheap little colognes, you feel me? You can go online and still find some cheap ones like I just showed you, you feel me? Just look at some um, clones of high quality fragrances. They got them for like 15, 30, 45 dollars, you feel me? You don't gotta spend that much. But yeah, my suggestion, just all the freshies in the back, throw them all away, bro. Just keep this front row right here, you feel me? And just start over from there. Though, these, this is good. It's not the best, but it can be revived. All right, next up we got, okay. He got a little light strip on his shit, and I see he got the, he, okay, he cool with the scent bird, okay? Give him a little bonus points, you feel me? Then you swipe to his next one, okay, okay, okay. It's a cool little collection, gang. And in my opinion, just keep what you got, bro. You feel me? Any more would just mess up how the collection looks, I, and I feel like it'll just be an add-on for no reason, you feel me? I'm really liking the collection. It's very versatile, you got some you can use for any occasion. But hey, I get this collection about a cool seven, you feel me? It's cool, calm, collected, but simple, but effective. That's all we like over here. All right, and for the one that's last up, okay, we got my boy, One Million Lucky, Spice Bomb, Night Vision. And then we got three samples right here. I can't really tell. So I'm gonna just focus on this One Million Lucky and Night Vision. So I feel like your next version of purchase should be something like Blue Chanel EDT, you feel me? Something to add a little bit more freshness to this collection. And it's more versatile, you feel me? You can use it on elegant night, or if you wanna go to work or school or whatever you in, bro. I feel like Blue Chanel would fit in this collection perfectly, but I feel like that'll start you off to keep on heading in the right direction. But hey, just off these two, just starting off, you know what I'm saying? I can't really rate it too. I'm not gonna get it very ready. It's just two fragrances. But you just keep on going, bro. You're heading in the right direction. But hey, that is it for today's video. I know some of you guys are gonna be like, this dude's still in reacting to my fragrances. I'm gonna unsubscribe to his ass. I hope his mama dies. Bro, I promise y'all, I'm trying, bro. I'm trying to get to all y'all. This is a lot. I gotta edit all this. Man. It's a lot, bro. But I'm gonna get to y'all when I can, bro. I promise y'all, these ready videos are not going nowhere, okay? They are still coming here. I'm, 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 I got y'all in the next one, okay? I promise I got y'all. I'm gonna keep on trying, bro. If I didn't get you in this one or in the last one or the other two ones, I'm gonna get you in the next one. If not the next one, then the next one. You feel me? Just don't stress it too much. I'm trying, bro. I'm only one person. But hey, man, that is it for today's ready videos. I hope you enjoy the rest of y'all day. Hope y'all feeling good, looking good, smelling good. And if y'all not, go fix one of those right now. But I'm gonna catch you on the next one.